Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel, Rich43. Hope you're all doing good. Guys, if you're not already subscribed, smash that subscribe button. Press the bell notification not to miss out on any videos. Give it a big juicy thumbs up if you like what you see. Comment down below and feel free to share the video. But yeah, it's Monday, guys, so that means it's Titanic Day and we're on issue 23 of Build the Titanic by Hashit Parkworks. So without further ado, guys, let's crack on. Let's have a look at this um, this week's mag. <clears throat> well, I'm learning not to talk there, guys, because I know that rustling is taking out of my voice. So I'll just go a bit quiet there while I, while I open the bag for you. Right, let's quickly have a take a look through this um, this week's magazine. So, yeah, that's what's coming in the next issue, guys. Starboard section of the hull plus an anchor for the port side. So you've got your usual information this month, um, this week's mag. Some nice pictures there guys, well they're not nice obviously, but detailed pictures of what was going on when it, the ship sank. Right, and what we've got in this week's um, issue guys, fitting the anchor winch. This looks a pretty simple issue to be fair. Don't look too bad. All right, so let's get the parts out of the box. As you know guys, if you're regular to watch my videos, this is what your parts will come in. Seal box, uh, all protected. Let's just have a look, let's just show you. If you're regular to the channel, you obviously already know this. But if you're new to the channel guys, I think I'll just show you how to come, come in a box like that, all sealed. And then you've got them freshly wrapped there, so it keeps them protected. Okay. So what I'll do guys, we'll get the parts out. And we'll go through exactly what parts we've got. I think compared to the last few issues, this is going to be a, a simplest one, should I say, dare I say. Right, so 23A is base of the winch housing, which is this part here. And this is plastic. Let's put that out of the way just for a second. 23B is cover for winch housing. Housing, 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 I think you say. Again, that's plastic. And then you've got 23C, which is the actual anchor winch. So that's interesting, that is. That's got a little motor in there, so obviously that's going to work when the ship's built. And that's proper string cotton with a little metal. I reckon that's going to hold the anchor. We'll see. And then you've got AP which is three 2.3 times five millimeter PB screws and one spare. So that's in that bag. And then you've got AM, five 2.6 times four millimeter PM screws and one spare. Okay, so instruction one, it is telling us to take, well, unwind it, six centimeter length of cable above, insert the winch into the base of the housing, housing, I'll keep getting that wrong guys, comment down below if you think it should be housing or housing, I think it's housing. 23A, so that the motor fits into the narrow compartment and the cable fit, fits through the slot in the side of the part 23A, like that. So that's how it's gonna look, okay. And then when we've done that, fit the cover 23B over the base and fix into place with two AP screws. Right, so we need this part. I'm going to place that just there at the top of the screen. And we're going to need, so that's 23A. This is 23B. I'm going to put those there until needed. And then on the instructions here, you'll see how it's laid out. That's what I'm going to do now. 
and then I want just to take to live that is <laughs> see if you've not got real guys that looks too to plan to me so I'm going to just go by that and take that as six centimeters that's about right so we'll do that and then get 23a as you can see there and then what it's saying do is if you can see there guys you've got like a little just bear my fingers guys i've had a curry tonight i'm just letting you know for our dinner and obviously with the chicken it's made my nails go yellow and i've not been in the show yet i've just done some gym work so bear with me if that don't look very good sorry i just thought i'd let you know right i'm not a hundred hundred smoker a day person or something like that no it's just it off the chicken that is it was beautiful curry though it's nice right so that's probably like that what we'll do is place that in there you know what, I should have had a sherry first, but I thought I'm going on the, the weights now to do some gym work. What's the point in having a shower when I'm going to get all sweaty again? There's no point at all, is there? Right. So what we'll do, you can use a ruler for this, guys. I, I haven't got one to hand, that's why I'm doing it this way. But if you look, that roughly is the way it is on the diagram. So I'm sure that's fine. I suppose we could take a little bit more off if you wanted to. But that's going to be enough. I'm happy with that. That was cool. Right, and then what it's saying do is get 23B, which I think it don't matter which way that goes around, to be fair. Place that over there, like so. You can see the little motor in there, and then the string, the anchor string, whatever you want to call it. So the motor's in there, that comes out. And we'll place that there for a second. Now we need two AP screws which are these ones here. I'm paranoid now about my nails, about that thumb. At least I've told you why the white gel guys. I'm sure you ain't bothered. Right, so I have got a magnetic one here. If you regulars to the channel, you know this is actually from a DeLorean build, this screwdriver, and it's still going strong. The magnetic's still strong on it. So yeah, I love this screwdriver. It stood the test of time, should I say. About four years old, this is now. Oh, and it's been through some stuff building that DeLorean. Talking to the DeLorean, guys. <laughs> I know that sounds a bit cliche, but if you want to take a look at the DeLorean, what I built a few years ago, I'm doing a recap on that at the minute. Um, you'll find it in my playlist. Take a look at it, see what you think. If you want to take a look, if you've got a spare time, take a look at it, guys, see what you think. It's a good build. It was a good build bit hard at times but it was that was my first ever model i built so i, I jumped straight into the deep end but it, it's a wicked model i really do love it right back to this build that's all done so let's turn the page over oh brilliant we've got to get the actual part of the ship now and then what we're doing is putting this into let's have let's take a look take the whole assembly from issue 21 that part there identify the four race screws screw sockets on part 13a which is that there with the yellow circles and um, fit the winch housing put it right housing in the hull so that the screw holes are aligned where the yellow circles are fix the winch base in place with four am screws um there those two pictures there and then that's going to be for this this issue guys that's a very quick issue this week right so let's pull this um model over minute it's looking good in it <laughs> really is looking good so if i just pull this out of the way a sec i don't want to damage this in any way obviously so if i put that there let's make sure that's safe yet yeah. and we need some am screws so if i put that there for you this is what we're doing here guys and if i just get four am screws out ready it's nice to have a week where you're not it's not a stressful week if that makes sense where it's, it's like take the foot off the gas a little bit especially last week oh that was a big one that was a long one right so it's saying 
and position it this way. I think you can see that on the video there. So what we want to do is make sure it's that way around. And then just basically line up the holes. Oh, that slots on as well, guys. So it's nice and flush, easy. And then put the four screws in, four AM screws. So let's get that on there. Yeah, I've just done a bit of gym work before I started doing this model. So that's why I might sound a little bit out of breath. And again, what I've just said, that's why I ain't had a show yet. Because <laughs> once I've done this model, I think I might be chilling out, getting a beer. Not in this order. Just basically having a show out and getting a beer. I'm going to swing that around a bit. So you can see the holes. Yeah, I might watch that... Um, new Maverick film, Top Gun. Um, I, I brought it about a week ago, two weeks ago, but I've just not got around to watching it yet. But the reviews I've heard is supposed to be pretty cool. So yeah, I'm looking forward to watching that. Have a few beers, watch that, chill out, put my feet up. Before another busy week of UPS work, delivering, and obviously YouTubing which I love guys and again I don't want to keep going on about it because I might be doing your editing but I want to appreciate all these subs I'm getting in the last couple of weeks do really appreciate it guys um, I've just put a vlog out uh, yesterday in fact if you've not seen that guys take a look um, it's just I think myself personally I did, I did go on a bit I did gabble on a little bit let's just take that off there so it don't break didn't so much cry but I was just a bit overwhelmed with how many subs I've got in a short value of time and I mean a lot of people YouTubers would probably say oh well, I don't know if any YouTubers would but people who are into YouTube would say oh 80 80 subs 81 subs it's not that many it is to me and I appreciate each and every one of you I know it's early days yeah and I would love to get more and it's just a what do they call it? A marathon, not a sprint. So I'm just doing it for the long haul, guys. I'm just going to do what I do. Do what I've been doing for the last 10 months. And then, fingers crossed, I'll just keep on going. And keep getting the um, the views and the subs. And keep getting your, what do you call it? Support, yeah. That's the word I'm looking for. But yeah, that's nice and tight now. These four AM screws. I'm just trying not to round the screws, but tighten them as much as I can. But as you can see, that's tight, guys. That's brilliant. And that is it for this week's issue. And that is it for this week's issue of the Titanic from Hashit Park Works, issue 23. Guys, that was a really easy one this week. It was just a matter of putting two pieces together with the motor inside of it. Four screws into the hull. Job done. Met the most of the easy ones guys I do because last week was totally different with those little windows and that check it out if you've not already checked it out but yeah that is it for this week guys if you're not already subscribed smash the subscribe button press the bell notification if you want to see more and more content on my channel take a look around guys look at my playlist and then if you do like what you see give it a big juicy thumbs up comment down below feel free to share the video and I'll see you in the next one next week we've got issue 24 of the Titanic from Hashtag Park Works next Monday. So click that bell notification guys not to miss out. I'll see you soon. See ya. Peace.